Hello everyone. Today I want to create a static blog for myself using GitLab Pages. So I searched Google and then I found this GitLab Pages documentation. So there are multiple ways to create a static website or blog. And one way is to use a project template. So I have to create a new repository. I have to select a template and then I have to use the template and then run a pipeline to deploy and then I will go to deploy pages to find the link let's come here so I create a new page I create a page from template I'm gonna create a plain HTML website let's name this dev AI and let's make it public development and AI let me create a project so now GitLab is importing the project template here we go now I have to go to build and run a pipeline run a pipeline run and now we have a pages job running so that job actually let me go and see the code oh it's already succeeded let me see the code for the GitLab CI YAML here we go so that's using Alpine latest docker image and deploying now did we really deploy let's go here let's go to deploy pages and here is my block impressive awesome so let's go back and let's make a change so I go to code repository now I'm going to go to the public I have a static page here what I want to do is I want to use GitLab web ID here we are I want to change this thing development author admin is my name development and AI block and then I don't need those links for the time being okay archive let's put here archive pages for the time being I have nothing development and AI block I will write about GitLab yeah. so Whoa, whoa. and let's now go commit to a new branch a initial website when I do that my online web ID asks me to create a merge request initial website okay block and I don't have any milestones or labels okay so hmm let me run a pipeline here here we go it doesn't run here okay let me merge that 
Pro and Neustadt. Now I go back to build pipelines and uh -huh. a merge pipeline is running. Let's see if it's going to deploy. Pages. Oh, it's already finished. Let's refresh. Here we go. A new static website. That's all for now.